Hi, welcome again to Mathematics Heuristic at Mavis. Today we're going to talk about journey in opposite direction. As the name suggests, two objects will be moving in opposite direction. What is the key thing here is that when the two objects meet, they would have covered a distance between them. Now let's take a look at the journey in opposite direction question. First, we will be able to find out what is the speed of car B. We were told that car B was travelling at a speed of 20% slower than car A, which means car B would have a speed of 80% of what car A has. Since car B is only travelling at 80 km per hour, while car A is travelling at 100 km per hour, that means for each hour traveled, car B will be 20 kilometers behind car A. Since they have been traveling for 6 hours, then car B will be 120 kilometers behind car A when it met the taxi. The question says that using one hour, car B would then meet the same taxi. That means the car B and taxi would travel 120 kilometers together in one hour. Since car B has a speed of 80 kilometers per hour, then the taxi would have to cover the remaining 40 in the, next, in the same one hour. Hence, the speed of the taxi will be 40 kilometers per hour. 